We're making exciting discoveries in the child study about the early life exposures and experiences that shape lifelong health. My research focuses on the role of maternal nutrition, infant feeding, and breast milk composition in the development and prevention of asthma, allergies, obesity, and diabetes. We've shown that breastfeeding is associated with several favorable health outcomes in the first few years of life, including a healthier body mass index, lower odds of rapid weight gain, a lower rate of wheezing, and a lower risk of asthma. Importantly, for each of these associations, the effects are stronger with longer and more exclusive breastfeeding, meaning any breastfeeding is beneficial and every feed counts. Links between breastfeeding, asthma, obesity, and food allergies have been seen in other studies, but the child study has uniquely found that the method of feeding also matters, meaning there's a difference between feeding directly at the breast or receiving breast milk in a bottle. Of the 3,500 infants and their mothers in the child study, the risk of asthma was lowest among those who only received direct breast milk for the first three months. There's a few possible explanations for these differences. First, infants who are fed at the breast may develop stronger lungs through the physical act of suckling. Second, the routine steps between pumping and feeding, such as freezing, thawing, and heating, might degrade the bioactive components of breast milk, which help protect against asthma. Most breastfeeding studies don't collect breast milk samples. This is a great strength of the child study. By analyzing the breast milk of our participants, we found that breast milk hormones, such as insulin and leptin, might help prevent obesity in infants. We also showed that certain profiles of complex sugar molecules called human milk oligosaccharides, or HMOs, are associated with a lower risk of infants becoming sensitized to foods. We're also studying other components of breast milk and have lots of results coming soon that we're excited to share. Finally, child study data are also showing that breastfeeding is a very strong determinant of the infant gut microbiome, the community of organisms or bacteria that live in the human digestive tract and influence nearly every aspect of our health, from our metabolism to our immunity and even our mood. We've found that breastfed infants have higher proportions of specific healthy bacteria and lower proportions of bacteria associated with obesity and other disorders. All of these findings from the child study are helping us to better understand the functional properties and protective effects of breast milk, which will ultimately help parents and practitioners make more informed decisions about infant nutrition.